Many times we try to deploy residential tactics into a commercial setting and it just doesn't work. So what should you do the next time you get called out to a strip mall fire? The crew is in Metro Atlanta to find out from author and national instructor Sean Gray on this bite-sized episode of Fully Involved. So in this scenario, we're talking about commercial fire attack simulating a strip mall fire. We're not getting the water where we need it to go. So as you can see, a lot of times we're, our nozzles are going straight up, just like the tip is here. Firefighters will get on scene and they'll deploy water up into the upper environment of a strip mall. If you think about what's going on up there in that upper environment, it's trusses, it's ceiling, it's all these other things that aren't solid for the water to actually go across and do proper water mapping like we know from FSRI research and what it does in the, res in the residential environment. So in this scenario, our burning fuels, the actual fuels from the fire are down low. Our fuel source is down low. That's where we need to get the water. That's why we have a distinct advantage with the TFT blitz fire because this nozzle will go all the way down and get down really low to be able to flow water onto the actual burning fuels. And that's where you're gonna see our firefighters do here as, as they come up and go through this scenario. Curious to learn more about the Blitzfire? Head to the all new tft.com slash Blitzfire page and there you can learn tactical usages of it, costs, comparisons, what other people are saying about the Blitzfire, plus all the content you could ever want.